Piers Morgan has labeled Meghan Markle a rank hypocrite after Prince Harry defended the couple's private jet use. Yesterday the Duke of Sussex insisted that he flies commercial 99% of the time and only boards private planes with Meghan Markle and baby Archie Harrison to keep his family safe. While launching his new sustainable travel project, Prince Harry admitted that no one's perfect after the couple flew on four private jets in just 11 days this summer. Elton John paid for Meghan Markle, Prince Harry to fly private to France. In a heated Good Morning Britain debate this morning, host Piers Morgan said he has no problem with royals flying around in private jets and driving gas-guzzling cars as long as they're up front about it. Describing Meghan and Harry as the high priest and high priestess of environmental preaching, Morgan raged, nobody wants to hate these two. But they are making themselves look like rank hypocrites and you can't as a royal do that. Meghan Markle's father blasts her and Prince Harry as hypocrites. Prince Harry, Meghan Markle carbon footprint fixer blasts private jet use. Earlier this year, The Sun exclusively revealed that Prince Harry had flown by helicopter from London to Birmingham two days before giving a speech on climate change. And in an interview with conservationist Jane Goodall, which appeared in Meghan Markle's issue of Vogue, the prince said he would only have two kids maximum in a bid to help save the planet. Labeling the couple hypocrites, Morgan continued, the queen would never espouse views like this because she knows the life of a royal is very hypocritical if you do. You can't fly on private jets every 10 minutes using this bogus excuse about safety and then preach all the time as they do about the environment. Prince Harry, Meghan Markle cut her father off after latest interview slam. Meghan Markle reportedly wanted to be a British reality star before meeting Prince Harry. The host then labeled the prince's safety excuse as nonsense and claimed that Princess Diana flew commercial British Airways 99% of the time and it was always fine. Former royal editor Duncan Larkham also appeared on the expert panel to weigh in on the discussion. He said, Prince Harry keeps trying to explain his way out of this. Referencing the prince's claim that he flies commercial 99% of the time, Lark added, he does predominantly do that. But this year, he hasn't. Piers Morgan thinks Meghan Markle is ruining Prince Harry. Piers Morgan blasts Meghan Markle, says she's using acting skills as Duchess of Sussex. However, a Mercian Viscountess Julie Motagu insisted that the public has to look at Harry and Meghan a bit differently to other members of the royal family. Praising the couple's social media presence and support of small charities, Montagu said, let's look at the platform they're creating, the two of them are doing much more than any other royal I've ever seen. However, Piers then pointed out that every royal supports small charities and that it's part of the deal for deal for getting the palaces the servants, Frogmore Cottage done up at taxpayer expense. In June, it was revealed that the couple spent $2.9 million of taxpayer money renovating their home at Frogmore Cottage, including installing two orangeries and a floating floor in their at-home yoga studio. Kate Middleton, Prince William fly commercial following Meghan Markle, Prince Harry private jet debacle. Piers Morgan blasts Meghan Markle for Donald Trump's snub. Meghan is looking like this, as, an American, she wants to be a celebrity princess, Morgan argued. But here's the bottom line, you cannot be political and be a senior member of the royal family. He continued, there's too much hypocrisy that goes with that position and also you're polarizing half your audience. Are we going to see Meghan spouting off about Brexit now? She refused to see Donald Trump when he came over. The problem is she wants to be a woke princess. The British public don't want their royals to be woke. Commenting on the prince's engagement in Amsterdam yesterday where he unveiled his sustainable travel venture, Morgan added, Harry looked defiant to me yesterday which is a worrying sign, like I don't care about all the allegations of hypocrisy, I'm going to carry on preaching to you and do the complete opposite on my own life. Piers Morgan says Meghan Markle is a bit of a social climber. Dot. Meghan Markle unfazed by private jet controversy. Addressing the prince directly, he said, Harry if you're watching, don't do that. You can't do both. 
you're either going to be a senior or a gas-guzzling celebrity who wants to preach about whatever. You can't do it all. Jumping to the couple's defense, host Susanna Reid argued that Meghan and Harry are still finding their feet in their new role but that their private jets had opened them up to criticism. Gail King defends Prince Harry and Meghan Markle after private jet fiasco. In more celebrity news, Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton don't wear diamonds before 6 p.m. to avoid looking flashy, an etiquette expert has claimed. And Prince Harry feared guests would able to see up the Queen's skirt after Peter Phillips installed a mirror dance floor at his wedding, a royal author has revealed.